What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Jump. Our boy Nelly out of St. Louis really has done a lot for that rap scene. You know what I'm saying? Um, I know him and Chingy, but Nelly is the one that really put it all together. I mean, nobody was really tripping off St. Louis like that as a hip hop um, scene, you know, and uh, he's really done a lot for the culture out there. Um, and, and with that being said, he's allowed himself to have a lot of opportunities. The Apple Bottoms, uh, the brand, you know, he had a whole bunch of the vocal. And, and, and obviously with that, women. Opportunities with women. And this is what black men need to understand. The better you are in life, and everything's not about money, but confidence to achieve these things gives you more opportunities with people. Okay? Here's what you would consider a high value guy. He's been doing pretty well for over 25 years. Now, what I want to talk about is Chantel Jackson. 37 years old. She was engaged to Floyd Mayweather. Here's a lady who wants a baller. Here's a lady who wants a high value guy. Floyd Mayweather, very successful. Don't do something that he's like, you're gone. Who does she go to? Nelly. Now, Nelly ain't got the kind of money Floyd Mayweather got. But the reality is he's still considered a high value guy. All right? She's been with this guy for seven years. At 37. And what we found out? They are no longer together. Okay. This is even after a year that Nelly was saying, you know, she's beautiful inside and out. You know, he wants to get married one time and all of this. But here's the reality. I'm going to tell you the reality. Now they're just friends. Well, no, why they're just friends? He dumped her. We don't want to talk about it, but that's the case. He dumped her. In my opinion, he dumped her. Okay? And the person that lost the most out of this is her. Very beautiful. Very attractive. I mean, she attracted a lot of high-quality guys in her life. But at 37... Probably not likely again. And I and I can probably see why. I'm not going to say it was her attitude or anything like that. I don't know. But obviously the guy been with you for seven years. He don't want to marry you. Why don't he want to marry you? Because what is he getting from you that he ain't getting right now? That's one of the things. If it's sex, he going to get that anyway. He probably gonna get more of that now than getting married to you. If it's assets, well, I don't think you got more than he got. Nelly don't wanna risk that and put that on the line. And probably why they broke up was because he didn't wanna marry her. But the question was, what did she bring to the table that other ladies did not? Because if she did, he would have married her. The reality is, is that the reason why they're just friends is because he didn't want to marry her. I'm pretty sure she brought it up. Pretty sure she talked about it. And Nelly was like, ah, uh, yeah, you know, I mean, let's just keep it like it is. You know, guys don't want to lose their money. Guys don't want to be tied down like that. And which is interesting because she was really real. She stood beside him when he got accused of rape. Okay? But the reality of it is, is that Nelly understood that, you know, he might like her, might care about her. But if he let her go, he can get somebody that's younger and cheaper. Chantel's 37. He's 46, but she's 37. 
maybe you have a lot of expectations, feel like she's deserved something, go get somebody that's 23. Somebody that's a little bit more able to be molded. And, and the reality is, is that if he didn't want to marry her, why does she stay? Like, that's the, that's the one thing that she was kind of hoping for. See, some ladies want to deal with a high-value guy. And I, I made a video about this with somebody else. But really, that's not what you're for. You should get with the guy that's a little bit more middle class. You know, I know you want to date somebody like Floyd Mayweather, somebody like Nelly. Like, a lot of those guys that are like that, they're not going to get married. You should have been okay with the, a nice lawyer. A nice doctor, which she could have easily gotten, as beautiful as she is. Now you're out the loop. Now it's over. Like, not all the way over, but you're 37. You know, it's gonna be a little harder now. Could have got a nice little businessman, nice lawyer, build with him. No, let me go for the rappers and athletes. Rappers and athletes don't make the best husbands and stuff. They have too many options. Okay? And so now you're sitting there like we're just friends. What does that mean? That means he has somebody else already. And you probably still will, will mess with him. You've been there for seven years and ain't nothing happened. So he can always have you, probably. And he's 46. So if he ain't getting married when he was 26, he ain't getting married when he's 36, why he need to get married when he's 46? Don't want to lose all this stuff. I mean, a lot of these guys see what's happening with other rappers. Dr. Dre and Nelly ain't got money like that. He understand what's going on. He can't come out and say it. But Nelly can get somebody that is younger, cheaper, more attractive, maybe. And these guys have too many options. Women always throw themselves at these at guys. Like, I don't even know why these ladies just want. Instead of just marrying a, 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 a good income black man or man out there that will be in a relationship, you go for the guys who don't want to be in serious relationships. Floyd Mayweather is never getting married. Okay. Never getting married. Never. Ever. Now you mad talking about, well, these guys ain't nothing. Why did you get with that guy? Okay. Why? Why? One, two, three years, the guy wanted to marry you. Why are you still with him? Trying to chase the unchaseable. That's what a lot of ladies do, chasing the unchaseable. And ladies need to, you know, instead of trying to, you know, get the top guy like that, you know, that everybody wants, get you a, get you a normal guy that, I mean, or, 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 or what is a guy that wants to be in a relationship. But you can't do that. And now look at you. So guys, what do you think? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. I really appreciate you for all that you do. Subscribe, hit the bell, check out the first cup at the top. And as you know, the buffoon remains at an all-time high. I'm out.